Hello. Uh, this time I made a bit more practical device that is a scientific calculator supporting a lot of scientific functions, sine, cosine, tangent, and logarithm, and pi, and power. And actually this is a small, very small computer, uh, but running uh, enhanced basic it's supporting a 6502 emulation and uh, let's see how it works uh, for example if we want to see 2.3 a 2 plus 3 we are pure and we know that this is a 5 the result uh, we can obtain but uh, actually at least I don't know the 2.3 for example power 10 I don't know, but it shows the result, some result as you see. And uh, of course, uh, this is a scientific uh, calculator, so for example, point sine, uh, for example, pi, oops, sorry, I need point uh, sine pi over 5 like that and the result is here like that and uh, I added several functions so we make a fundamental program for example 10 space for example 4 space I equals to 1 space 2 space uh, 10 and uh, we can see the rest yes like that uh, actually this is a program of a uh, calculator so we can make the program as same as a basic computer and uh, let's see for example uh, again uh, let's uh, 10 space i equals to 1 or something and uh, 20 space i equals to i divided by 9 and uh, 30 oops yeah space print i i like that and uh, 40 space uh -uh. go to go to space uh, uh, 20 and let's see how it works long yeah as you see the floating number is correctly showing and uh, maybe as a last the value will be under flow 31 32 35 36 10 to yes and on the 10 to minus 39 there this small computer getting their underflow and also overflow at the 10 to power plus 33 and uh, actually this computer also uh, this is inside it's it's not clear it's not clean but here's a battery and here is a SD card slot so the future function or for the future function uh, I can use this SD card slot have fun.